Greetings everyone, I am Lord Malvern, and welcome back to our Stellaris multiplayer campaign featuring myself and Arthanex. Say hello. Hello, I'm unpausing. Alright. So, in, in our last game, I... Oh. Oh. Sorry, I accidentally took something from uh, the Zeltec. <laughs> Uh, during during my war. Okay. You you didn't mean well. That doesn't really matter, right? It's not like it's impossible for you to get to. No, but it's uh. It it is rather isolated as well, but uh. So I I can't actually put it into. Into any well, I'm gonna have to create a sector for uh, for just for it, I suppose. That's fine. So, uh, what have you been up to, Arthanex? I'm just uh, kind of colonizing and um, waiting for my fleet to finish upgrading to my new weapon system so I can try them out against the AI. Mm -hmm. As soon as they're done, they're at 92% now, then I'll be going back to war. Very good. Yeah, I um, have to go start exploring other uh, on the gauge or patriarchs destroying things, of course, to take the maniacal guy. All right. Um, Starvation on Davi Jalen. Somehow I also acquired two systems. Maybe the uh, the Ikerzuri. Maybe they must have lost a frontier outpost at some point somewhere because I now have two of their systems that I didn't have before. Hmm. Okay, well that could be. Yeah, I, uh... My leader died. No, that's not happening. Jeez, I've got to send a science ship yes. over to research all this debris. Might as well. Ooh, battleship build cost minus 20%. Oh, is that the uh, the ship, the battleship uh, construction yards, or uh... no? It's a it's a potential guy who I could elect. Oh, uh, that's it's pretty nice. He's a repatriator, so I'd never fulfill his um, request. But I probably wouldn't fulfill the other ones either. How old is he? He's forty nine. Yeah, I'm gonna elect him. Okay. Because I'm going to be building a lot of battleships. <laughs> he yeah. also has colony build, ship build cost and colony development speed bonuses, which are also pretty useful. So I'm going to have a non Arthetil ruler for the first time. Probably. Unless the, guy, unless the guy I supported doesn't get elected, which has happened. Obviously. Yep, that could not happen of course uh... Uh, nope he got elected battleship focused frontier spirits Okay. 
Uh, Alright, so... Oh, wow. And the Andagonge had neutron torpedoes. System survey complete. surveying the system, that's good. Time for you to go survey these other systems. Maybe we'll find that uh, precursor artifact we're looking for here. Construction complete. Okay. Alright. Back to what I was going to do. Xenophobes, probably not. Uh... Oh, I meant to enslave all of you. I guess that's them. Maybe. Going after the Ikarzuri now, huh? Yeah. Oh, more power to you if you can keep the Rathlaknak distracted. Been wanting to go after them for a while. Though I'll have to wait until my turn on the uh, on the seat here, which is going to take a little bit longer now that the Tumbator Combine is in here.
Construction complete. Debris analyzed. System survey complete. Very interesting. Fleet, uh, fleet capacity of the neighboring fallen empire is only superior to me now. Their fleet capacity? Yeah, their fleet capacity about... and their fleet, uh, fleet power. Excuse me, I, I, I did forget to mention that part, too. Oh, okay. Hmm. What do you think the end game crisis is going to fire off? Uh, I don't know. I think we probably have a little while. Hmm. And it seems like it's. System I'm reaching the the time when when it fires. It usually fires off for me. That's. <sighs> All right. Actually, it's trying to. Should be a bit nice here. Migraine to Gretch. Where's that? planet. Whoops.
Hmm. Debris analyzed. All right, I do have a tundra world here that could. Consider putting some. I'm gonna research that to get rid of it. It shows up every single damn time, so at least I'll get a new, a new choice every time. Hmm. I don't really want it. At least it's fast. Uh... Where? Wait a minute. Why haven't I built anything here? Okay, that's not actually in our space. Oh, you're attacking me. Oh, they're actually attacking you. Uh, let's see. You guys get up here. No. Quit asking me for star charts. So battleships are only costing with the battleship construction yards and the leader, they're only costing 1,600 minerals each. That's pretty damn cheap. Yeah. It's 40% off. For, oh, 40%. I, you, you must have cut out there because you said 100 minerals each on mine. Oh, no. 1,600 minerals each. Oh, okay. Yeah, that, that's a more reasonable figure. I was trying to figure out... Like, what kind... What combination you would have had to have... <laughs> achieved to, to, to get... Get them that cheap? Yeah. Yeah, they have nothing on them. Yeah. Uh, uh, that would do it. <laughs> it's just the hull. That's all. They're just, yeah. It's just the plain hull. Uh, right. They should have no problem with that. Okay. Let's see down here. Actually. Yeah, alright. Incoming transmission. What a dull and soulless place your materialistic nation must be. Tell me, have you invented a sense of humor yet? No. <laughs> a pity. Uh, thank you, Rafalaknak. System survey complete. Uh, for the, uh... Actually... Yeah, fine. Let's finish these guys off first. Oh wow, you're Captain Luke. 
He must have lost your old capital. Your capital's all the way to hell over there. It can't possibly be your homeworld. Yeah, you know, I've noticed the AI likes to. Oh, I just uh, got a new species of Elden has cropped up called Trans Elden. Oh, fun! Dabby Gavis. Am I gonna catch that? I don't think I'm gonna catch these guys. Well, maybe I will catch them. But yeah, I have noticed that the uh, the a AI will s will frequently seek out to uh, liberate uh, somebody's home world. So I, w I would guess the uh, Republic of Nugan probably has their old home world. System survey complete. Not a hostile fleet, that's just a mining station. Hmm. Oh man, these are committers just dis absolutely destroy Corvettes. Holy crap. <laughs> Destroyers, too. They just freaking melt. Oh, I lost a cruiser. Oh. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, these arc committers are really good. <laughs> Yeah. Holy crap! <laughs> they, I mean, I you know I would have I would have beat these guys anyway, but I don't know. It, I don't know. It's hard to tell because it's not equal force on equal force, right? I, right. I, even with the reduced force power, I'm still outforcing them like six to one, basically. So pretty much anything I did would have destroyed them. Yeah. But man, they destroyed them way faster than my old fleet with torpedoes and. Um, and uh, torpedoes and strike craft would have. Right. Yeah, that's basically where I am now, where I'm... Uh, I, I still am pretty far behind in tech, because, I, you know, I just don't have a, a lot of it available to me. Capture that planet. Capture that planet. But, uh. But yeah, I am. I'm still winning battles just because of overwhelming force, is really the, the, the key there. Alright, I'm gonna send a new fleet that I just built. Well, it's not new, it's three battleships, which is about 4k. 4.6 force against a 4.4k fleet and see how they do. Um, I suspect I'll lose, but we'll see. We find a... Do I have space yet? Oh, I have an admiral who's not doing anything. System service. That's a shame. It would be kind of funny if I could have uh, 
used my civilian access with the interstellar mesh bend state to colonize this uh, arid world that they have inside of their borders. That's just going completely un uh, unclaimed. Oh yeah, I can actually see what Soul's like now. Okay, so there are humans on Soul. They're just All right. so so far this fleet, this even battle fleet. Yeah, all right. I'm gonna win, and none of my ships are gonna get below 75% hull strength. And this is a 4.6 on 4.4k hmm. fight. Yeah. All right, I take it back. One of my ships is gonna get below <laughs> 75% strength. It's down to about. 55%. But, yeah, these three battleships just completely destroyed these guys' fleet. <laughs> Alright. Construction complete. Army. Why are we all of a sudden losing so many energy credits? Oh, we're having a strike. Great. It's the second time I've done that. I wish they'd tell you how long the uh, uh, recently conquered thing took to wear off. Yeah, I wish that too. That would be nice. So you here. Pacifists. Hmm. You know, it's a good way to get pacifists on your side, right? Enslave them. Slavery is outlawed in my empire, and that's not going to change anytime soon. Hmm. All right. All right. planet looks like 
Yeah, alright, 100% happiness. Hostile fleet. No oh, worry. Bombing. All right, that's done. Kidding me. The transport fleet is here. Let's take that planet. All right. Well, I still have. Clearly, I still have some. Species to eradicate here. Ooh, I want another army. You guys are my strong ones, right? are strong and earthbound. Yeah. I'm going to recruit nine armors on this planet, though. Uh... sector. Oh so, yes, here it is. Where is this planet? It is in the, that system. Okay. Hmm, looks like the, the Trans-Elden have removed Repugnant and Sedentary and put on uh, put on Adaptive. That's good. Are they still the same uh, homeworld type, or? Uh... Yep, still ocean. Situation log updated. Uh, looks like the timer went off a little while back. Yep. Are you in a good spot? I uh, I think so, yes. Alright. Uh, is this me or you? Uh, you know, I don't actually remember. Is... This is uh, you. This is you. Alright. So... Uh, thank you very much for watching. If you uh, liked the video, be sure to click on the like button as it does help out the channel. And of course, please be sure to subscribe to Arthnex Games for his perspective. And uh, as always, I will see you next time. Take care. Bye, everybody. <laughs>